Good evening and thanks for watching WGXA News at 11. I'm Raymond Tubb. Well, our top story tonight and breaking earlier this afternoon during our 5 and 6 o'clock newscast, a 15-year-old was hit by a car at the intersection of Riverside Drive and Spring Street in downtown. WGXA stopped to speak to witnesses and also the victim's sister. I saw him go up in the air. I saw when he made contact. Just after 4, a car hit 15-year-old Sherrod Brooks as he crossed Riverside Drive. Witnesses say he was walking from Hutchins Career Center over to his mom's job. I was sitting there at the red light, and he was coming with his sister and brother. Um, we were just walking, and he was coming this way, and we were going that way, like he was coming across. And before we could tell him that the car was there, like he was already in the air. He tried to avoid it, but she still tagged him a little bit. She hit him. He went up in the air. Came down on his head and right shoulder. Got up and ran over here and went down. Well, they went up 911. The Bibb County Sheriff's Office says that 43 year old Wendy Woodcock of Macon was driving her Mercedes SUV when Brooks crossed in front of her. Investigators say Brooks was not crossing at the pedestrian crosswalk, and other witnesses said that Woodcock had a green light at the time of the accident. Right now, there are no charges. Brooks was taken to a local hospital and listed in stable condition. No charges have been filed. The accident is still under investigation, and if you've got any information, you can call the Bibb County Sheriff's Office at 751-7500. Investigators say the accident is a good reminder to use pedestrian crosswalks when you are crossing a busy road.